We're running maintenance on this 5,000 pound beast. Boom. <laughs> Got him. And these soldiers are taking ownership of their vehicles. We want people to say, that's my Humvee. That's a direct reflection of yourself. Or anybody's gonna look at you and be like, you know, what's this guy gonna take care of his vehicle? With the help from the Sergeant Major of the Army, Eddie! This is Maintenance Holland. We're here at beautiful Fort Huachuca, and today we're gonna check on some maintenance. Maintenance is critical to the success of our Army and the systems we use to help soldiers on our battlefield fight and win our nation's wars. So let's go see what our soldiers are doing in the maintenance bay. Hey, soldier, what you doing there? Oh, Sergeant Major of the Army. I'm hey, Special Captain. Tracking on my weekly PMCS. That's great. I came down here to see what people were doing on uh, maintenance. Is there anything okay. wrong with it? Uh, we're about to find out. Would you like to lend me a hand? Yeah, I'd love to lend you a hand. Let's get started. What do we got to do? We've been using Humvees since the 1980s, and they've taken a punishment. That's why maintenance is more important than ever. And it all starts with a technical manual. And we always got to use the team, because the team is going to keep us in the right order and to allow us to know what to check, when to check, and how to check it. Right. I want him to be able to look at the vehicle and, and go through each intricate part of this vehicle, making sure that it's ready to go. Because the worst thing that could happen is we say, oh yeah, it's good, you get out there and it's not. Make sure that drive staff isn't loose at all. As a non-commissioned officer, you should be out there with your soldiers. Don't just tell them, hey, go ahead, get that PMCS done, and then you're not there. Be there, be effective. Okay, so what we're gonna do here is make sure the tire tread is good, there's supposed to be wear bars on here, but these tires evidently don't have them. So, and then you're gonna look for cracks too. You wanna make sure there's no there's no cracks in here. If there is, you gotta put it on the 5988, and then you gotta get you gotta order some new tires. Um, otherwise, in this heat, it'll actually explode, and you don't want that to happen. On all Army vehicles, checks are required before, during, and after any type of movement. Also, they are done weekly, monthly, annually, and depending on the part, even more than that. So the only way to do this is do it properly. Get the proper equipment with the proper protection and get under that vehicle and check for leaks. You can't just get down on one knee. You gotta make sure you get underneath that vehicle. Check all the appropriate places to make sure that vehicle is ready to go and mission ready for every mission when it's called to do so. What we're looking for, is it, is it properly uh, level or what? We're looking for the proper level and then the color of it. Um, make okay. sure it's in the cross hatches. If it's if it's not in the cross hatches, then you gotta, you know, top it off. And it's full. And it's full. Yeah. I just remember when I was a young soldier, I had my name on the side of that vehicle, and I took pride in the fact that my vehicle was ready to go at all the time. And if it broke down in the field, I was personally embarrassed. That was my vehicle. It was my responsibility. And we got to build that sense of pride into every single soldier and every single piece of equipment we have today. We don't know what we're gonna fight tomorrow, SMA. We don't know. So we don't. what we do know is that well, we got the soldiers prepared. Equipment repaired, we'll be ready. Everything is looking good and ready to go. We're here at Fort Huachuca, and you just got Maintenance Hall. Are you so let's start talk, uh, stop talking. Two soldiers texting with the phone. I'm sure. All right, so you got your cell phone with you? Two of you are going to be texting back there. We're going to catch her all that. It's going to look natural. Army strong! Thought we were saying Army strong. <laughs> Oh, oh.